final thing I'm always trying to do when I, when I do my watercolours is mix on the paper. So I've got my deep mixing wells here and I will use them. I'll mix colours in there as you'll see. But wherever possible and whenever I can I'm going to try and mix it on the paper. And, I, and the, the first wash really shows you what that means. So we'll, we'll get started on that. Okay you can first job then get some water and just start to wet and I'm just I'm not going to go to the edges um, I'm just going to do this at, at random I don't know if you can see that in the shine of the light but I'm just doing it at random just a bit ragged bit, and I have ragged edges I'm, I, I'm quite happy with them on this kind of picture so there we go and you see that pen stayed fast masking fluid protects the paper I'm finished with that brush now in this next phase I'm going to do the first wash and I'll take my biggest sable brush which is my 12 and I'll start to mix myself some colours I'll get some raw sienna you can see it's a lovely transparent yellowy colour love, it's a lovely colour raw sienna and, and, and make, make note take note of how wet this mix is I'll just squeeze it with my fingers there you can see I'll just give it about quite a wet a lot of water in the mix squeeze it with my fingers clean my brush get myself some burnt sienna lovely terracotta colour come on sometimes I take a bit of get going these I've, I've actually topped this one up as well there we go burn sienna I'll squeeze that in there drop a bit of water in and there I've got my burn sienna burn sienna colour Going to get myself some cobalt violet and this is as i say i use winsor newton paints this is winsor newton's cobalt violet you might have a different brand of paint and you'll have a cobalt violet but it might not quite be the same hue the same color don't worry about that it'll be all right and i know that i'm saying that because i once i think i think it was derwent's i tried on this was just fine but it just wasn't quite the same color that i got used to some cobalt blue and I'm going to mix myself a green but I'll do that a little bit later I won't do it straight away it's going to be in the first wash but I just won't do it straight away I don't know why so that's some blue I'll just dry my hands a little bit there and I'll get myself a little bit cadmium orange put that in there it's quite an opaque watercolour cadmium orange I think a bit of water in there drop the water in so there's my mixers nice and wet so as I go to get before I start to paint I've dropped some on there and before I start to paint I'll get some raw sienna go to there and just bring it in and don't be too careful don't be too careful at all a bit more raw sienna I've even gone over the blue but I'll show you what we'll do about that it's not a problem it's not a problem let's just bring a bit up there So that's my raw sienna. Remember, I said we're going to mix on the paper, on the paper as much as we can. So let's get ourselves now some cobalt violet and just throw it in up there. And what you see now isn't what you'll see in a minute because the paper, the paint, and the water are going to work together to mix that. And look at the grain on the paper, it's just beautiful, just what we need. It's like stewing it for you, it's really nice 
and I'm just going to add a bit of orange in here just to Okay, so that's not so bad. I'll just put my palette down a minute. I'm going to make sure my brush is dry. And I'm just going to lift a bit off the lintel. It'll cover in again, but it'll just it'll lift just enough to give a bit of a difference. And I will just lift off. You see that? I'm, what I'm doing there is I'm drying the brush. You can dry it between your fingers. I'm using a tissue and just lifting off some of the paint. You might say, well, why did you paint it anyway? Well, I did that because I needed to be free and I needed to be loose. And you don't have to have it absolutely pristine and white. If you did, we could have, there would have been a lot of masking fluid, but we could have done that. So I'll do the other side as well, just to get it clean to take the blue. That's fine. And I'll go down the brush now for these next bits. I'm going to go down to a number eight brush even in this first wash get myself some cobalt blue and just start to bring it in on the shutter and things will mix in it but don't worry don't worry about that that's part of the beauty of what we're doing I'll just get some there 